this is the same classic Sonic fan. And Bowser Man 101, and I'm playing some Sonic 2! Monkey, uh, monkey, monkey, monkey. I'll be filming him, um, playing through Emerald Hill. Bam. And then yeah. he'll film me playing Chemical Pow. Plant! Pow! Ah! Like uh, Pow! Ah! Uh, uh, this game was a masterpiece of the Whee! Sega Genesis. This game was released in November 1992, and this is the game that truly uh, took the Sonic series to new heights. Oh, look at this! Some argue that this is the best Sonic title, and while I, while well, I believe Sonic 3 and Knuckles uh, holds that title, uh, I still have nothing against people who believe this is the best Sonic game, because this really is an amazing Sonic game. Bowser Man 101 uh, thinks Sonic Unleashed is the best Sonic title. No, I think it's the best 3D Sonic title. I, I believe One time with you. you told me it was your favorite side title as a whole. Eh, but I think I I changed my opinion. I didn't like that game at all. Well, okay, the daytime stages weren't that bad. Although, I think I've changed my opinion. But my my favorite 3D Sonic game is Sonic Unleashed. But my favorite Sonic game overall, it has to be Sonic 3 and Knuckles. It's just a match. Uh, exactly. Hey, look at Continue. I I didn't like Sonic Unleashed at all. Well, at least I, I didn't like the nighttime stages. I oh love my that. gosh! All right, come on. Just try something new. Sonic Colors is the best modern Sonic game, but the what best Sonic Generation doesn't that count. Uh, actually, that's behind Sonic Colors because Sonic Colors was a new experience and true. Dang it! Ah. <laughs> Are you ever going to enter a special stage? I I missed a uh, uh, a, a checkpoint when I collected you missed, the rings. You missed a oh, computer monitor containing rings. Oh, the, you don't have to. Dang it! No. Okay, uh, Gotta collect rings. Yeah. Have you ever thought of getting Sonic 3 and Knuckles for the original Sega Genesis? I don't have any money to do, but once I get enough money, I will. Uh, I have it on the PC, but of course, I've also played through it on mm, the frickin' GameCube Dang. in Sonic Mega Collection, and I played through it on the Xbox 360. When you have Amazing one. as frick game! And then did your Xbox red ring. That's probably what happened. Stupid red ring. That was just a stupid idea. Red rings? Oh yeah, in Sonic 4 Episode 2, they play no role! What the frick? Yeah, I have to agree with you on that one. Uh, just go to Dr. Eggman already. No, gotta collect 50 rings. No! Not yet! Not yet! Not yet! Not, 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 not. Uh, <laughs> uh... The special stages are really hard with Tails! Almost got it! He always... He always runs into bombs! It's stupid! Almost got it! Almost what got the frick? That's why I usually go into special stages in Sonic the Hedgehog 2 with either Sonic only or Tails only. Okay, I got 50 rings. Or at least 50. Technically, I don't, come on! Just go to Dr. Eggman. No, I gotta collect 50 rings. <laughs> Boing! Or, as I, or more preferably, Dr. Robotnik. And the because that's what he was originally known as in, in the world. That's what he was originally known as in the Americas. Bam. Bam. Uh, the chemical plant zone boss is easy. Bam. Bam. Yeah, you can 
Uh, hit him more than bam. You know, you can hit him more than one bam. time. Bam. Uh, every time. I know, but I just like doing this screen. to prove how pitiful he is. Uh. Bam. <laughs> bam. <laughs> nice job, my friend. Bam. Then get back here. All Kay? right, now free the animal, friend. I think something's wrong with Sonic. <laughs> Alright, All right. switch. I'll take the helm. Alright. We're back. So at last you know, time. you can actually break the laws of physics in this game. You can ca actually catch up with the screen. Oh. In this stage. I know, but you shouldn't be able to catch up with the screen. Hey, you got 50 rings. Uh, Sonic Lost World will be a great game. Oh, yeah, and to IGN, or should I say Ignorance, ah. and GameSpot, or should I say Game Spoof, well, here's a little message to you. Your reviews were horrible. They weren't even professional. And guess what? Sonic Lost World will will be better than how you attempted to make it sound. Mm. Oh yeah. You wanna know a little fun fact? Get GameSpot <clears throat> gave Bubsy 3D a higher rating than Sonic Lost World. How is that even possible? <sighs> Bubsy. No! Uh, Alright, now find a goal post so you can get into the special stage. I already have 141 rings. Still, get to the special, special stage. stage. Darn it! You okay, dude? Uh, yeah. Yes, he wears glasses. This, is, this has to be my worst. Uh, hey, look, oh. you gotta continue. This is <sighs> this is a terrible run. My arms are tired. Mm, now you know how I felt, my friend. Why weren't you complaining? Mm. Yeah. Sometimes silence can speak a lot. Oh yes, we are playing this on the original Sega Genesis. That's right, you freaks. Unfortunately, I don't have a Sega Genesis. I do! But one day, one day I want to get... Or you have 69 rings! Ha! <laughs> 69. I used to have a Nintendo... 69! All right! I used to have a Nintendo Entertainment System. All you guys out there know what 69 is. And oh, you... Game Boy Color. You know. You know. What are you talking about? No. Anyways... Anyway, jump into the jump in it. Yes. This special stage is easy as frick. Of course, this is the first one. But the second special stage is hard when you have tails with you. When you don't have him with you, it's freaking easy as frick. But when you have him with you, he always runs into bombs. He is an idiot, you know. Why is frick? Why can't he just fool you instantly? The one aspect that Sonic 4 Episode 2 improved is that Tails cannot lose rings in special stages. That should have been a plus. That should have always been true. They should yeah. never... That's just a cheap way to lose rings. Yes, I've never, I've never acquired seven Chaos Emeralds with Sonic and Tails in this game, but with um Sonic only. Yes, I accomplished that. Hmm. <laughs> Mm -hmm. 
All right, now she. Bonus. It's it's a it's a chaos element. Anyway. Kill the spider. All right, when we get to Dr. Eggman, show everyone how easy that boss is. Well, I think everyone knows how easy it is. Not everyone has played this game, you know. Not everyone knows about Sonic the Hedgehog. Not everyone knows about Mega Man 2. Not everyone knows about Dr. Wily Fortress uh, Theme 1. Most people do. Why did you randomly bring up Mega Man? I've been watching some called Johnny's Mega Man reviews, all right? They're good. Come on, don't mention other YouTubers. I can't. Hey, hey, it's my channel. I can do what I want. Besides, there is no fourth wall when it comes to YouTube reviews. I guess. All right. And there is no fourth wall in Kid Icarus, uh, Kid Icarus Uprising. There is no fourth wall at all. I hated that game. Well, Kid Icarus Uprising, that game was great. The controls were horrible. It was still fun when you I got seriously? used to them. No, it's not. Yes, the, the Kid Icarus and Kid Icarus of Myths and Monsters was a freaking plat or freaking platformers. Yeah, well, the what sequel doesn't doing? have to be. The sequel does not have to be. Nintendo can do what they want. It's supposed to be a retro revival, you know? Yeah, but that yeah, and they're doing it oh, in a different way. You're not doing the trick right. You're not doing the trick. To see, so you're not doing the trick. Gotta do the trick, Whatever, man. It's still easy. Those are some realistic explosions. It's still freaking easy as frick, boss. No matter if you use a trick or not. Alright. Well, you think we should end this video there? Yes, my arms are tired. <laughs> oh, my stomach. They are you okay? Dude, shut up. Dude, shut up! He has gas.